is going on everybody? My name is Northy and I am so so excited to be showing this one off to you guys because uh, I've got a card that I have yet to get and uh, it's a very very special one to me I think. It's going to be really really exciting to see it. Uh, I have not seen the design in person, I've seen it a lot online. Have not been lucky enough to pull it, but today I am very excited to be ripping this bad boy open, having a look at the beautiful card that's inside. You guys already know what it is, although I have not seen it yet. I am so, so keen to see what it looks like. And I am so, so keen to see what it looks like. I'm hoping that it's as good as it's been uh, advertised. I think I've got a bit of the sticky tape on me. I can't tell. Nonetheless, let's have a look at the card. Please be good. Oh, it looks really good. Oh, <laughs> yes, sir. Got ourselves a beautiful neon star powers. Ben Cunnington. Wow, I love it. The color design is phenomenal. I love the black background on the neon color. I'm trying to pull it out here, but I really don't want to damage it. But nonetheless, I'm super excited to be showing this one off because it, uh, obviously for North, I'm really, really excited that uh, we got a North card and I've accidentally taken it out without the sleeve. But look at that. It's in beautiful condition. Shout out the seller who I got this off of. Got it for a decent price and it's in beautiful condition considering it was only sent in a top loader, that's a really, really good condition. Here we go, let me get the sleeve on this one, but uh, hopefully the code hasn't been used on it. If it hasn't, that's fine. But wow, this is beautiful. I love the look of it. The shine of the neon on the back is so nice. It's so nice in person. Again, the neon coloring of it all is super sick. Um, I don't know if I've got a, te if, if I've got a team star powers on me to kind of compare it, but it's a lot more of a general shine with the team star power. Like the entire thing is shiny and it's beautiful, the team star powers. But the neon, it's like, it's specific to the neon colouring in the back. And it is perfection. I love it. And of course, it being a North Melbourne one in Ben Cunnington. He is not playing, however, the beautiful thing about neon star powers are that whatever team you get it for, like whatever team you pull it for, if you put in the code for a neon star power, I believe it gives you every single player's team star power. So I've now probably got every single team star power, I think. Yeah, I'm not 100% not sure, but uh, I will have to double check. Um, if the code hasn't already been used. What's interesting is it's got no different coloring on the back And I think that's the same for all of them because I see this on the both on the team star power and the silver star power Although well, I'm just interested the neon is like straight just black and then team on the back But I cannot complain the design is beautiful. I'm just in love with the look of it I love it so so much. I don't know where I'm gonna put it in my album I'm not too sure because it really doesn't have a spot. I've got a, I've got um, a spot for my star powers but they're rain mainly for like team and silver as i'll try to complete the silver one obviously that'll um fill up but i've got no for my neon so maybe i'll just keep them in top loaders for the moment until i eventually find a spot for them but i love the look of it it's so beautiful the neon star powers absolutely stunning stuff now we're gonna go to nine packs of Team Coach 2022. I'm gonna admire this for a little longer because, oh man, it is so good in person. But I'm gonna open up nine packs of Team Coach now. Uh, let's see what we can get in that one. Hopefully some uh, big hits in there as well. Maybe a case hit like this, who knows? Let's see though. Hopefully some good stuff waiting ahead. And here we go, we got nine packs of Team Coach here today. Uh, I couldn't get the 10, as there were only nine remaining in the box that I did find. However, nine is what we usually do for a pack opening. So it's good to kind of get an idea and a gist as to what our regular pack openings look like. Because we have been spoiling you guys, getting that extra pack in for the most part. 10 is not usually what we go for. But uh, we got nine here today. Hopefully next week we start with a, a fresh box. So we got four straight weeks of good content, but nonetheless, Nine packs of team coach. Let's see what we can do here today. Hopefully get ourselves a nice card. As per usual, the rules are box hits are good. They're our main goal. Or sorry, our aim. Like the lowest bar we can hit. But our aim, um, the one we really want is a case hit. Anything case hit related is really what we want. Uh, but nonetheless, we will take a box hit. Box hits are always nice. But we're starting this one off. As per usual, we're getting ourselves at the silvers to start. Got to look for those commons, as per usual. Got to look out for them. But we've got James Sicily, Ebony Marinoff, and a Giants Cardcraft, number three, Tim Taranto. Pretty sure I have this one for Tim Taranto, but nonetheless, start up with the Cardcraft. We'll take a Cardcraft to start. We've got Papley, Pern, McDonald, Cochin, and May. Yeah, I'm more than happy to start off with Cardcraft, but please, please. Save a gold card craft in here for me. That's all I want to see. Just one gold card craft. Please. 
Uh, but yes, we do have ourselves that neon Ben Cunnington now. Really happy to see that on uh, the collection now. I love the look of the neon colors, man. The neons look sublime. They look supreme. But we've got ourselves here a Jeremy Cameron. Uh, then a Liam Baker. And it looks like we have ourselves a canvas. We got ourselves a canvas. Oscar McInerney. And a, 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 oh, this one's really shiny. I don't know what's up with this one. But Oscar McInerney. This one looks really, really nice. <laughs> okay. Uh, we've got Caleb Sarong. Adam Trelaw. Will Pale. Taylor Adams. And Aaron Hall. That one looks almost way too nice. <laughs> I don't know what's up with this canvas. It's extra shiny. And it's cut well. This, uh, this is good signs. <laughs> this is good signs. I don't care what anybody says. This is very, very exciting. But, um... Yeah, I'm hopeful to get some more neons because I do really like the look of the neons. Uh, this one does not look too good though. We got ourselves Charlie Dixon, uh, Caleb Daniel, and it is a big old footy flips of the Geelong Cats. Gotta flip him, gotta flip him. We got Mitch Duncan. Oh, it's not not focused very well. Jeremy Cameron, uh, Mark Blitzarves, and Paddy Dangerfield. Try and go. Oh, I almost messed it up. Hold up. Bang, bang, bang. Bang. That was not fast. Hold on. Eh, eh. Oh, I messed it up. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Footy flips. Geelong. And we got Charlie Dixon, Zach Dewey, Jamal Horton, Jordan Ridley, and Riley Philthorpe. But uh, hopefully, we can find something nice in here to go alongside that Ben Cunnington. But other than that, I also want to talk about uh, the AFL this week. So glad North isn't playing at the moment. I'm just not interested in watching another game of North at the moment. But um, hopefully things get better. Uh, hopefully these are the tough times that we can look back on and just be happy that we got through. But we've got Tex Walker here. Marcus Blondin-Pelly. And another canvas. Bailey Smith. Interesting. Very, very interesting. <laughs> we'll move on very quickly. Alira Lee Todd Goldstein. Ebony Marinoff. Harrison Jones. And Tom Hawkins. Yeah, best not talk about that one. <laughs> Let's keep going. Uh, yeah, hopefully we can get more than just these silvers. I'm not too interested in these silvers, team coach. Let's, let's move on from them. Jane Laverde. Kiara Bowers. And... Got ourselves. Just another canvas? Oh my goodness. Tim Kelly. 131. Another camp. We got three of the four canvases in the box. James Sicily, Jake Stringer, Ellie Blackburn, Jordan Dawson, and Kane Lambert. How many packs we got left? We got four. Can we find a case hit or a box hit? We need to aim low to start. Aim low. But we've got four packs left. Let's hope that uh, we don't get left out to dry here. Um, Hopefully, I'll have some more stuff to open up as well. Um, not packs, but just unboxings as in like, what the hell? The lighting is having a fit in here. That is interesting. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Maybe the, maybe the room's haunted. Who knows? <laughs> but let's hope that um, there is a box hit hiding in this one. We've got Jordan to go in. As the lights keep going on and off. If you guys can see that, that is strange. But we've got ourselves our first star powers. Andrew Gath. Nice to see. That's our first star powers. I'm okay with it being our only star powers, please. And we've got Jared Lyons, Jay Gresham, Sam Taylor, Cam Guthrie, and Jordan Dugowie. I think at the time I'm recording this, North Melbourne are 1 and 12, which is nuts. I'm so glad I've been to the only game that North have won this year. <laughs> I went to that game, and so at least I can say my experience this year has been somewhat positive. It was good to go to that game. Although it wasn't a necessarily a convincing win, it's good to at least see a win in a season where it feels like you can't get any. Uh, we've got Aaron Phillips, Hunter Clark, and we've got ourselves another card craft. Hawthorne, Jay Gromira number one. think it's one we already have, but again, I love a card craft. Toby Green, Ed Langdon, Charlie Cameron, Hunter Clark, and Nick Natanui. Yeah, so hopefully in the second half of the season, as we're pretty much in the second half of the season now, I think we have been for a couple weeks, but... I want to see another North win. I'm glad they got the buy this week because now I can actually enjoy the week without feeling too stressed. But, uh, ooh, this one looks exciting. I'm very, very keen to see what this one is. Ooh, this could be fun. All right, let's get into it. We've got Jack Darling. We've got James Orpel. And it's looking like it's a Gold Coast Star Powers. Now, we do have Noah Anderson. I can't remember who the other ones are, but just hopefully not another Noah Anderson. I'd like to see a new team Star Powers. Come on. Be nice to me. Go up. Don't be future. Don't be future. Classic. Is that David Swallow? It is David Swallow. Classic team Star Powers. We'll take a new one. That's beautiful. The Gold Coast colors look great. I love the Tyson Beck design. I say it all the time, but that is a really, really nice one. We'll take a David Swallow Gold Coast. It's a new one. Probably won't use him, but it's good to see a new one. It would have been really nice to get like a, a top-notch player 
Uh, like a, I don't even know if a Petraka would be even top notch now. Maybe a Clayton Oliver. Clayton Oliver, I think, is is in the star powers. Would have been nice to see something like that. Or any other really good team star powers player. But David Swallow will take it because it looks really nice. Bang! Just like that. We've gotten the uh, box hit that we've been looking for. We got Dylan Moore in there as well, though. Paddy Cripps, James Stanton, Tom Lynch, and Lockie Hunter. That's what we want to see, though. We want to see some box hits. I'll put you back here, Neil. But the last pack. Let's see whether there's anything else hiding. Maybe we get extra lucky and hit the last one. We don't know. It's going to be. No, it's no special ones. <laughs> I think I see a star power in there, but that's all good. Carl Amon, uh, Mark Blitzarves, and Tom Mitchell. Superstar powers. Good to see Tom Mitchell. Love that. Beautiful. Well, okay. We'll take it. We'll take it. It's not the greatest box hit in the world, but it's a box hit nonetheless, and we like new ones. Michael Walters, Elliot Yo, Matt Flynn. Jack Crisp and Jack Viney off a really, really good week for him. He had like 138 team coach points, but other than that, David Swallow team star powers. The gold and red look is beautiful on the design of the star powers card. Glad I got now two of them, Noah Anderson and David Swallow. Again, won't be using him, but uh, very happy, very, very happy. Um, I think my classic spot is occupied with Luke Parker, and Luke Parker is not losing a spot for a while, I don't think. Unless David Swallow has himself some good stretcher games and I decide to make the switch, this will just be a card to chuck in the collection. Very, very nice. I'm happy. Uh, we'll take it. We'll always take a box hit, as I always say. The aim is the box hit, but unfortunately no case here today. I'm really excited for the next chance we get to see commons at the front because it's been a while, man. It's been a good while. Let's hope it changes up soon, though. But... Thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed everything involved. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.